Installing Bistock 360 is very straightforward. It comes as an installable MSI file. Once you have downloaded the MSI file from the website, you go to Start menu and, and click CMD. And from the list, you right click and open a command prompt with ad administrator rights. You navigate to the folder where you have uh, downloaded uh, Bistock 360. Uh, I have stored that in a folder called uh, Bistro 360 release a CD video for this demonstration. So you simply install the MSI file and you need you can watch out for a few things. Uh, it comes with a fully uh, signed certificate so you can verify the publisher here uh, it, when you click the run, run command. Click next. Uh, read through the license agreement and accept it and click next the installer comes with set of predefined checks so just to make sure a uh, bistock 360 can run smoothly so it, it tests various things and gives you corresponding errors uh, if in case it can't it can't find the prerequisite required to run bistock 360 in, in this machine uh, we got everything configured so it's it's all green click next the combo box lists all the the websites uh, in the in the server. You choose the one uh, where you want to install uh, Bistock 360. The and, and you can leave the default names for the virtual directory and the application pool. Uh, you just need to specify the the service account credentials. One, click next. Specify the the SQL uh, instance name where the database for Bistock 360 will be will be stored. Uh, in this particular machine, we got a named instance, so I'm going to choose the instance. Uh, you can leave the default database name, or you can modify it. And based on the authentication, whether it's Windows or SQL, uh, you you choose the right one uh, appropriate for your uh, requirement. Click next, uh, and you can leave the the system account to run as a local system account if you are ever evaluating the product in a, in a local machine. Uh, click next. It just gives you the summary. It also gives you the option to change the folder. Uh, you, you can you can choose to install the website and the Windows service in a, in a completely different folder if you want to. Uh, for this one I'm just going to leave all the basics uh, and click install. Okay, once the installation is, is complete, the installer should automatically open a new browser instance and navigate you to Bistock 360. So installation of Bistock 360 is very straightforward. It shouldn't take you more than five minutes if you got all the prerequisites configured in the server.